Well, Saint, as you know, St. John Bosco, we've, we've removed a lot of snow there this winter. Uh, I've been on the phone with our roadways department a number of times. I'm, I, I know, I don't know, I haven't met you before, but I'm familiar with you. Um, so we've reacted a number of times to, to make things safer there. But we do have rules. Uh, we, can't, we cannot push snow onto green spaces uh, because of the contaminants that are in the road and that are contained in the snow when they come off the road. And that's, those are the rules we have to follow. I'm glad you're here tonight. And again, I think you and last time you and I talked, I said that um, in order to get at some of these issues, we need people involved uh, to help us maneuver and navigate through these things. So I'm glad you're here tonight, and I hope that you'll continue to uh, to be to be uh, aware. And I'll keep you aware of what's going on. But um, uh, at St. John Bosco, we we've removed a lot of snow from there this winter. In fact, we've I can say we've gone above and beyond at that particular school. So. And I'm not here to argue that tonight. It's just yeah, one of yeah. one, another factor. So. And, and I think your comments mirror what I've heard at other schools as well. Yeah. Some of the concerns. So it's certainly something we need to consider how to address. 